It's uh, coming to the scenario one, and this is the patient who has come to us at uh, 30 weeks period of gestation. She is a primary gender patient and comes to us with a BP record of 160-100 with headache. Lights, please. Ma'am, ma'am, hmm. there is Mrs. M who has been referred with pregnancy induced hypertension. Her BP today is 160 by 100 and she also gives history of headache since 3 hours. Oh, Yes, yes, ma'am. I'll be charting myself as per standard Pritchard's regime. Okay. How is the sister preparing? Sister? Uh, yes, doctor. How are you preparing Maxil for this patient? Uh, doctor, I'm giving her 14 gram of Maxil, 4 gram IV dose uh, with 20 percent concentration, and then 10 rest of the 10 gram as IM dose in 50 percent of concentration. Hmm. But you don't yes. get 20 percent in your supply. How uh, are you going to give 20 percent IV dose? Uh, yes, doctor. The ampule that we get in supply here contains 2 ml of drug that is of 50 percent weighed by volume concentration and it contains 1 gram of magnesium sulfate. So, for IV dose, I will be taking 4 gram of the drug that makes 8 ml and to that I will dilute, I dilute it with 12 ml of normal saline that will change the concentration to 20 percent. And for the IM dose, I will take it straight away from the ampule without dilution, 5 gram in 2 different syringes and to that I will add 2 percent of lignocaine solution and I will be giving it uh, in both the buttocks uh, in deep IM. Yeah, very well. Go ahead please. Thank you, Doctor. Mrs. M. आपको ना अभी एक दवाई देंगे क्योंकि बीपी है और प्रेगनेंसी है और आप हेडेक भी बोल रहे हो ना उससे आपको दौरे पड़ सकती है ठीक है तो उसको बचाने के लिए आपको एक दवाई दे देंगे जस्ट रिलैक्स ओके सिस्टर काइंडली स्टार्ट विद द मैक्सल आई विल बी लुकिंग एट अ पल्स एंड वाइटल्स आपको अभी मैं जो दवाई देने वाली हूं उससे आपको थोड़ी गर्मी फील होगी और आपको जैसे उल्टी आने जैसा मन लगेगा बट आपने घबराना नहीं है लंबी-लंबी सांस लेते रहना ये इफेक्ट आपको थोड़ी देर में कम हो जाएगा और अभी मैं आपको ये दवाई देने वाली हूं कहाँ से आते हो वैसे आ? अच्छा। ओके। सिस्टर आप आईवी दे रहे हो अभी? हाँ जी, मैं आईवी ड्रग दे रही हूँ। I'm done with two gram, giving another two gram dose। ओके। हाँ, वो थोड़ा सा लगेगा, don't worry। डॉक्टर, can you help me in giving lateral position to the patient, please? Yes, yes, sure. And this one is deep. Uh, this one is deep. Oh. I am in giving the five gram axle toes. And now on the other side, please. Shivani, you let me know the blood pressure and the spot urine albumin once they are done with the maxil. Okay, okay ma'am. Right. Thank you, doctor. Okay. Ma'am, I have just checked her blood pressure. It's 140 by 90 millimeters of mercury and her urine albumin is 2 plus. Okay. You have started her on any oral antihypertensives? Oh, yes, ma'am. I have charted tablet levitolol 100 milligrams twice daily. And what investigations are you sending? Ma'am, I am sending her uh, workup for PIH, which includes platelet count, okay. hemogram, coagulation okay. profile, her RFT, electrolytes, and LFT. Okay, fine. I think that's okay. Darshan? Yes, ma'am. This patient is coming now. Let's assess the fetus. Yes, ma'am. Just now I was doing the same. Mm -hmm. The fetus appears to be appropriate for the gestation around 28 to 30 weeks, mm -hmm. and yes. the uterus is relaxed, and the fetal heart rate is also reactive and reassuring. Okay. And what about her clinical symptomatology? Ma'am, uh, right now she doesn't have any symptoms. Luckily, the headache has settled, and the BP is also 150 by 90, ma'am. Okay. Then let's proceed with detailed sonological assessment, okay. and then we we'll think of a CTG. So all this while. So all this while patient kept calm, ultrasound was being done for the fetal status, BP was checked every two hourly. Please note down. Okay, I'll write. Mm -hmm. So it's a 30 week of fetus kephalic presentation. Okay. Like is adequate. Mm -hmm. And the baby weight is just 1.1 gram. Shivani? 
short some steroid for this preterm fetus with that baby weight i wish that the pregnancy continues a little more and we are able to gain some weight here so okay. chart the steroid right now the baby looks all right okay ma'am i'll ch M. chart it abhi aapka bachcha theek hai aur aapka bp bhi kuch behtar hai pehle se i hope hum pregnancy abhi aur continue kar payenge hum baat kar sister yes doctor i think you are maintaining the strict urine output for this patient uh, yes doctor the uh, intake output records are adequate mm -hmm. now okay. i'm maintaining it and please instruct her that she collects 24 hour urine for uh, protein quantification okay. coming morning i'll provide theek hai okay mrs m i'll provide you with the collection bottle you have to collect and your 24 hours urine in that yes yes i have sent time sadarshan you collect the investigation sure. in time and let me know okay okay and what about the max self monitoring chart yeah. have you made it in the yes file? yes ma'am uh, all have you charted ma'am uh, for a patient that she is getting max self i have been charting her pulse blood pressure mm. early and urine output respiratory rate and deep tendon reflexes also mm. So ensure that everything is in order, that her respiratory rate, her DTR, and urine mm. output are adequate before you give her another okay. dose. And let me know the investigation. Who is collecting the investigation? Ma'am, ma'am, I'm getting it. Acha, they have already come, ma'am. Okay. Acha, investigations. Hemoglobin is 12.2. Mm. Platelet 1 lakh 85 thousand. Mm. PTI is 93 percent. Mm. And creatinine is also 0.6. So I think everything is within normal limits. Mm. So yes. we'll just continue with the max self, and mm. shall be able to continue the pregnancy now. Mm. Expecting management. Mm. Yes. So let's go ahead with. This. Okay, ma'am. Okay, fine. So people, to summarize, our patient Mrs. M is a case of preeclampsia with severe features. So 24 hours have passed now. Magnesium sulfate chart is properly maintained. Her BP records are chart. in the normal range. Input output record is also well maintained. So let's see what happens the next day. Ma'am, we have completed 24 hours of magnesium sulfate for Mrs. M. Okay, how is she doing? Ma'am, she is fine. She doesn't have any complaints of headache, and her BP records are also under control with labetalol. And anything bad in fresh hematological? Ma'am, uh, today's fresh hematological investigation says her uh, hemoglobin is uh, 11. Everything in order. Yes, everything is fine and with the normal. And 24 hours urine protein you must have collected. Yes, ma yes, it is 350 milligrams, ma'am. Okay, mm. and no fresh signs. Ma'am, mm. I think we can shift her to ward for further monitoring. Yeah, looking at everything, I think she can be considered mm. for a shift out. Let me have a look with her myself. Mrs. M, कैसे हो अभी? अच्छा, अभी समझ नहीं है. आप 24 घंटे से हमारे साथ थे अभी तो ब्लड प्रेशर भी ठीक है सर में दर्द भी नहीं हो रहा है हमें लगता है अब आपको इमरजेंसी एरिया में रहने की जरूरत नहीं है आप वार्ड में बेहतर रहेंगे तो हम आपको वार्ड शिफ्ट कर देंगे वहाँ आपका ब्लड प्रेशर चेक होगा आपको टाइम से सिस्टर्स दवाई देंगी पर आपको भी अपनी दवा का ध्यान रखना है और अगर आपको कोई सिर में दर्द हो पेट में दर्द हो उल्टी जैसा लगे आँखों से धुंधला दिखाई दे तो आपको डॉक्टर ऑन ड्यूटी को बताना है तो आपको हमारे पास वापस शिफ्ट कर देंगे Hope you have a good pregnancy, okay. ma'am. You make arrangements for her shift out, please. See and uh, Shivani, the steroid cover is done. I think so. It has been given, but one last dose is due, which can be given in ward. I think. Yeah. Okay. Just okay. ensure it's in charge. Okay. Okay. So, people, to summarize, our patient Mrs. M is a case of preeclampsia with severe features. We achieved her BP control with oral labetalol. We gave her magnesium sulfate for the prevention of eclampsia. All her maternal biochemical parameters are in the normal range. Ultrasound and Doppler examination for the fetus is also reassuring. So, we shifted her to the ward for the expected management.